Anatom Field Solutions here with a video showing the various options that you get with the EOS Tools interface app for the Aero product line of receivers, including the Aero 100, the Aero 200, the Aero Lite, and also the brand new Aero Gold uh, coming soon. And the cool thing about this app is it has your standard interface uh, information here in the position tab. Uh, for the status and we can see our latitude and longitude and our elevation height. Uh, we can also see the estimated horizontal accuracy, uh, the HRMS there. This is a narrow 100 submeter, so it's about 40 centimeters. Keep in mind that that's in, in meters there. The VRMS is our vertical estimated accuracy. And then we can also see in the bottom right there our differential status. Right now it says DGPS, meaning that we're receiving SBAS corrections, our free satellite corrections from the WAS constellation above North America here. And that's what gets us down to submeter work. And then the diff age there, it bounces between four and seven, meaning that we're out in the open and about every seven seconds or so, we're receiving a new set of correction values from the SBAS satellites. The other thing of interest here, if we look at our top line there with position satellites and map view, and we tap on satellites, we can see a satellite plot there showing uh, the various constellations our receiver is currently receiving location data from. So you can see we are connected to the GPS constellation, about seven satellites, the GLONASS constellation, about seven satellites, and the Beidou constellation we're getting about three of those satellites at the moment and this is a unique factor to the aero product line of receivers is that it can receive location information from three constellations simultaneously including the SBAS constellation uh, because that a lot of other receivers can only do two at one time, meaning they're just going to do GPS and GLONASS and receive their SBAS corrections that way. Another thing we're looking forward to is the activation of the Galileo European constellation later this year. We'll probably switch the Beidou option with Galileo because it'll provide uh, four to six satellites uh, versus the two to three or so with the Beidou. So we're very excited about that. Uh, there's also this map view. It's not super exciting. Um, you can't actually do much with it. You're going to spend most of your time over here in the position tab. And then if we also look down here, we've got a terminal tab. And this is just shows the NMEA data coming in. And as long as that's scrolling, that's good. We know we're receiving our information. We also have an alarm tab here. And the cool thing about this one is we can set our lost connection option there. So if for some reason our Bluetooth connection between our iPad or our other tablet is lost with the Aero receiver, this will start beeping at us. The other thing that would be of interest, there's a lot of different alarms here for submeter work with an Aero 100, the HRMS, the horizontal accuracy. Let's say we're doing some sort of work that requires us to no matter what, be under a meter and a half of accuracy. We can tap this guy here. And if during our work, if our estimated accuracy goes above one and a half meters, the device will start to beep an alarm at us. If this was an Aero 200 or an Aero Gold doing uh, RTK correction work, we would want to set our differential age uh, alarm here. Let's say we set it at five seconds because we want to make sure that every you know one to three seconds we're receiving a new set of corrections through our cellular service from the RTK network that we're working with. And we want to make sure that it's going to alarm us if for some reason our cellular connection loses those RTK corrections flowing in from the RTK network. And then we also have the differential tab where you can see one of our other videos talking about using the Aero 200 with the RTK and that goes into detail about how to set up your RTK correction access for achieving your submeter or I'm sorry your centimeter work. So let us know if you have any questions you can email us or call us and we're more than happy to help you with questions and set you up with uh, our sales staff or our rental team to get you out in the field collecting the data you need to collect.